All right, guys, top of the morning to you. We're here at Darbone Lake. First day of pre-fish. Check it out. You can actually see the lake right there. We're staying at the local motel. Darbone Motel, I think it's called. That yeah, sounds about right. But check it out, guys. We're about to put slabs in the boat today. Bringing you to the Darbone with the Savage. We are loaded up right there. Let's do it. All right, guys, welcome to Darbone, baby. It doesn't get much better than this. Big fish in this lake. We're hoping to show you some of those today. Beautiful morning. All right, that gives us the first fish on Darbone, guys. Looks like about a pounder, maybe not even quite a pounder. But we now know what we need to look for. There you go, beautiful fish, caught on the Savage. What do you got, optimized sniping braid? What do you got? Meteor. Meteor, he's got the 12 pack. I think I might have to switch the... Uh... There you go. Right. Whoo, baby. Good solid white. Right there, guys. Slab, baby. So, guys, we're just dropping on these vertically, looking for big fish right now. First day, so we're learning a lot just based off of how the fish look. And currently, we're utilizing the Savage as a 13 footer, and it looks like that's about right for right now. For those that don't know, the Savage can be can be modified to a 15 or a 16 footer, and we do have them rigged up as such. Okay, that's a seven six, probably. That's a definitely a good fish right there, guys. That looks like a dandy. Mike's gonna put it a hurt on it. He's fishing today with his own invention, the Slabjacker. You guys can check that out at Brush Pile Jigs. Slabjacker. Does it look like it now? There you go. Wow, good fish here, guys. Great fish. So guys, if you don't know, Mike uh, invented and patented a new bait called the Slabjacker. And he just caught that on the Slabjacker. You guys can check that out at Brush Pile Jigs. He'll show it and kind of show you a little bit about it. We're going to weigh this here real quick. There's the Slabjacker. He'll walk you through that. That's a great looking fish, Mike. That's a tournament fish. Definitely. So yeah, the Slabjacker is available. He's actually, we've actually been fishing with it probably for about three or four months. Uh, it's available at Brush Pile Jigs, so you can check that out. Um, Savage is performing perfect. But I'll let Mike talk a little bit about the Slabjacker and kind of walk you through the, the idea and the philosophy behind it. Okay, everybody. So the idea behind this bait was to put a blade at the back of the bait to mimic a fish's tail. These blades do not spin. They just flop back and forth and they come in a tube skirt version in a 1 8 and a 1 16 ounce and we have a hair jig line in the same weights also and they're all through brush pile jigs so is the idea behind the fin that you're going to get just more action or yeah it was just to give it a little subtle uh action behind it sometimes if the fish are a little finicky and they've seen it all this works really great sometimes just to put it down there in front of them give it a little twitch works as a swim bait you control with it long line with it it has great action Awesome, there you go. You go. I'm starting to wonder if that's a fish. It might have been two. Is that him under there? Yeah, there he is coming he's out. Coming out the other end. Yeah, he's out I there. I thought he bumped it, but I thought I hit the branch too, so I couldn't. Got him. He might be worth weighing. 
Good fish here, guys. Just laying on a log. Bam. Good fish. Ugh. No, no question there. Boom, guys. Good fish. All right, guys. I want to take a moment just to kind of go over the Savage 13. Now, the Savage 13 is available at some fantastic bait stores. I'm not going to list them all, but I'll tell you, Grizzly Jig, PTG, Fast Eddies, some really great stores out there, and there's plenty more. Uh, the Savage 13 is a 13 footer, uh, just absolutely stunning, uh, that actually can be turned into a 15 or a 16 footer. And in fact, I have it already modified to a 15 footer. So I have three Savages in my boat, and I like to keep two of them as 13 footers, and then this one here is actually modified added the midsection here to turn it into a 15 footer and that's what we're going to fish with here now we're going to switch over to the 15 foot savage again the reels match up three pound fishing and we are fishing with the optimized 10 pound from sniping break that's my go-to on these big lakes um mike of course told you before he fishes with the 12 pound now we are loaded up with the bait pop too as well you guys can check them out Fantastic product. I love this catfish version. For whatever reason, I think it's more, it, it really gets a bite going. I've had a lot of success with the catfish version. So check it out. Um, the Savage 13, like I mentioned before, Grizzly Jig, PTG, Fast Eddies. Those are the three newest locations, including Dunn's. Actually, I want to bring that up. Dunn's in Peavely and Marion, Illinois, also has the Savage 13. So doesn't get much better, guys. There we go. Finicky little bites. Was that the same fish? No. Oh. Negative. All right, guys, we're gonna do a little move here. Uh, just trying different areas on the lake, different depths. Um, but right now, we've definitely found a spot that we feel pretty comfortable with, with a lot of fish. So now we're just trying to find bigger fish, stay in the, stay more in the creek channels, and see if we can't make that work for us. A little bit bigger. That's our smallest one, 125. 128. 128. I ain't gonna hit 128. I'm loving this 15 footer. Big fish. That is a tournament fish. Look at the belly on that bad boy. Woo, baby. All right, guys, that's gonna end it on that slab. That is a monster. All right, guys, it's about a 1.7 right there. Beautiful fish right now. Big old belly of eggs. We'll take pictures with that one later. Check out the Savage 13, the Slab Jacker, the Sniping Braid, all these things are getting her done. You gotta love it, guys. Savage 13, I absolutely love it. Fishing with the 15 footer. Mike's over, switched over to the 15 footer as well. Putting slabs in the boat.